Greetings, beautiful Gemini, and welcome to your December 2022 What's the Tea Taroscope. Thank you so much for joining us, Gemini. My name is Trey. This channel is Experiential Energy Anatomy, and we're delighted to offer you the objective information of the latest astrological transits affecting Gemini energy with extra support from the tarot. So let's jump right into it. This month, your ruling planet Mercury enters Earth sign Capricorn December 6th as represented by the Queen of Pentacles energy. And we also have a full moon to follow on the 8th in your sign, Gemini, as represented by the Lovers, Major Arcana. So you look at these images in order to intuitively interpret how is this energy manifesting this month in my story? Remember, dear lovers, in any romantic entanglements this month, masks or appearances may be deceiving. And it may be important to ask the questions, any casual connections, who is the real person behind the dating profile? What mask are they presenting to me during the day? versus who they really are at night when no one's watching them. What are they hiding from me when they're getting to know me initially? In this Terrascope, we will be pulling three cards representing the following primary three energies. One, the conscious. That may be what you already know or have come or seeking confirmation on regarding the person, place, or circumstance you're inquiring about. The second car will represent the subconscious. That is what is currently hidden from you regarding the person, place, or circumstance you're inquiring about. And the third car will represent any possible outcomes or the spiritual lesson. Okay, Gemini card number one, the conscious. We have the major arcana, the hierophant. Taurus energy as ruled by Venus. Okay, we have Uranus retrograding in Taurus. The nodes are retrograding along to Taurus, Scorpio axis. Definitely sensing here, Gemini, you're on a search or someone's on a search for the hidden truth here within all your commitments, well, as with a person, a job, a place, or a circumstance. I'm sensing here this search that someone is on. It's not only a search for truth. It's a search for meaning. It's a search for what what, what is truly meaningful for me. Is sex even meaningful even anymore? Is attempting to try even meaningful anymore if it's not for a greater purpose. I'm sensing here with the full moon in Gemini, again, commitments are being tested. Now card number two, the subconscious, what's being hidden from you, Gemini, beyond the horizon, perhaps, is some type of conflict here with the seven of wands, fire energy, valor. You can see here the symbol of Mars. Mars is retrograding still all month in your sign, Gemini. So I'm sensing whatever this conflict is about. It's about your free will, your desire to break free of some type of old karmic pattern that no longer serves you. But ask your spirit guides, your higher self, what is this karmic pattern that needs to be defeated. There's an energetic requirement here to break free again of some type of energetic obstacle, some type of challenge. And I'm just sensing here, this is about how you're managing your sexual energy, your kundalini. So see, what are the possible outcomes, the spiritual lesson here? 
you have Gemini, the Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Discs, Wealth. Yes, I'm definitely sensing here there's an important opportunity to acquire some assets, to make some acquisitions. If you can focus your energies. I'm sensing that this full moon in Gemini may be a time where you want to be very social. You want to go out and be amongst people in a social situation. But I'm sensing heading into the new moon in Earth sign Capricorn, that this is a time to buckle down, uh, make some lists, right? Use the powers of your mind, Gemini. To come up with some awesome new ideas, new projects that will give you an opportunity for long-term generational wealth. So to review here, we have the Hierophant, Major Arcana, the Seven of Wands, okay, and the Ten of Pentacles. If you are interested in diving deeper into this trine of cards, and head over to my Patreon page for the extended Need to Know Terroring series. We'll clarify the hidden supporting energies, especially whomever is embodying the Hierophant energy in your story, that strong Taurus archetype, a potential karmic connection, a potential uh, for certain love connection there, a spiritual partnership. Well, let's see what is the final advice for Gemini. What is the final oracle message spirit that Gemini has a need to know in order to apply this information with discernment to their story in December? There she goes. Okay, Gemini, all my social butterflies, your final oracle message is the goddess Saraswati, the goddess of music and learning. Creativity and wisdom flow from the gods through your tongue and from your hands. Study, create, teach. Wow, this is a powerful message for you, Gemini, during a month with the full moon in Gemini. Definitely sensing here you should... Play some Saraswati mantras in your space to cultivate this creative energy, to connect with the creative muses in your story, to go out there and channel the goddess Saraswati, to be the master creator, the master architect of your own story. Thank you, Spirit, for this final oracle message. And thank you, Gemini, for attuning today. If this Terrascope resonates with you, every single comment, like, share, subscribe, and donation to this channel is truly appreciated in order to grow organically and get these messages out to more people who have a need to know. And remember, if you are curious to dive deeper and know more about today's combination of tarot cards, you can head over to my Patreon page for the extended Need to Know Tarot Ring series. Patrons also receive access to a variety of other members-only content, such as the monthly astrological newsletter, discounts on personal reading packages with me, in which we gain the most accurate information regarding your personal love life, professional path, or spiritual path, and direct questions with me. Please also remember, this is a general tarot scope. Take what resonates and leave the rest knowing you are ultimately the master of your own story. Toulouse.